Hey guys, welcome back to another can review. Today we're checking out Parallel 49's Trash Panda Hazy IPA. What a name, I gotta say. Fantastic can art as well. It's just a panda digging through trash. He's got a fish bone. It looks like a beer. He's a drunk panda. He looks like an angry raccoon. Really does. Angry ass raccoon. Parallel 49 Brewing Company out of Vancouver, British Columbia. Canadian. Um, it says, yeah, hazy IPA, 5.5%, one pint. 5.5%, what does it say? Hmm. Oh, yeah, it does. The urban trash panda will spend most of its life scouring garbage bins for the dankest, ju juiciest hops that the Northwest Coast can offer. Don't be fooled by this bandit's cute little mask. This snarling vermin won't leave any can unturned. All right. Let's dive in and see what Trash Panda brings to the table. Ooh, it is kind of hazy, huh? Definitely okay. hazy. Okay. So this okay. one's got cashmere. I mean, at least on the website, it said cashmere, laurel, Simcoe, and... Citra. Citra. Okay, so this should be automatically because it has cashmere, which we like, and citra, mm -hmm. which everybody likes. It should be good, Trash Panda. It says ladies and gentlemen at the top. I don't know why it says that. It doesn't say ladies and gentlemen, and then on the opposite side it says welcome to the show, or look what the rock is cooking, or anything like that. It says ladies and gentlemen. Introducing Trash Panda. <laughs> I like how hazy it is. Yeah, it is really hazy. Or it's that got that the, nectar juice. The nectar juice that we were talking about in the uh, precarious review. Mm -hmm. Not so much of a in-your-face hot presence, but it's definitely got that kind of silky, smooth kind of character mm -hmm. to it. Maybe a little oaty. Smells like. Yeah, I'm definitely smelling like the oats. It reminds me of the smell of like grain. Mmm. Yeah. Like those bags of grains at breweries. Yeah. The, the, the strongest one I think I've ever smelled is at Devil's Backbone, the Lexington location. The first time we went there, we, were, we like drove up in our car and we got out and the, the first thing Sandra said was like, you said, why does it smell so weird? And we were like, oh, it's the grains because they were, they were graining out right as we drove up. That's right, they had to. And they had this huge like mill on the left-hand side of the brewery. And that it's I like, remember. Yeah. yeah, it was like seeping out of the actual building too. It was awesome definitely reminds me of like the grains when you go on those tours and they ask you to like chew on the grain or they ask yeah. you to chew on the malt. That's what this smells like. Yeah, it sure does. Nice lacing on this. Not bad at all. Should we dig in? I think so. Cheers. Cheers. Definitely, definitely kind of danky. Mm -hmm. It doesn't have like a huge amount of body, but it's more body than I expected out of a 5.5% beer, that's for sure. Yeah. This kind of reminds me of the Green Man Wayfarer IPA. Mm. Do you remember that one? We did that one too. And we were like, Sh that's good. I think that's the first initial reaction I had was like, Sh So I'm not getting as much tropical, tropical ness I was expecting, but that's okay because I'm getting melon instead. Yeah, it's heavily melony. And that, you know, primarily comes from all the dry hopping they did. They must have thrown a ton of hops in there. Holy crap. But it's not really bitter. It's like super smooth. It's smooth, yeah. Oh, it's good. Yeah, for a five and a half percent beer. That tastes, that's all trashed out, man. They threw everything in there. Well, Canada, our hats are off to you, my friends. Uh, Parallel 49, good job. That is, that's a good beer. Maybe Canada's taking some pages out of the East Coast playbook for their beers because that tastes like something that we've had before. Imported by Iron Horse Beverage, Melville, New York. So they're definitely distroing down here. I would love to get my hands on more of Parallel stuff, honestly. Like, this was great. I wonder what else they have. We're gonna keep an eye out for that. Yeah. I wonder what Parallel 49 even means. Okay, I'm gonna nerd out for a second. It's gotta be the longitudinal line on the planet that their brewery is closest to, or even on. We think okay. about that. That makes sense. I don't know. Yeah. Maybe? 
All right, guys, well, that does it from us. If you're interested in more craft beer reviews or beer event coverage, please be sure to hit that subscribe button and maybe leave a like while you're here. Until next time, stay crafty. Cheers. Oh, three. Nineteen ninety one. Yeah. Or nineteen thirty five. <laughs> ten thirty five. Two thousand thirty five? No, ten. Ten of thirty five. <laughs> that was after Christ. <laughs> <laughs> That's October of, of I like how they, they have on the can it says beer. Like the French. Because like British Columbia, I guess. Alright guys, well that does it from us. If you're interested in more craft beer event co why do I keep doing that? Craft beer reviews, that's what we do here. That's our thing. We gotta, okay, we gotta Google Vancouver's these on the west side. We gotta Google them. Weird cartoon. There's some weird shit on this webpage. I dig it. I don't know, it says a bunch of, just like a bunch of mumbo jumbo. It's like a story of long lunches and short tempers, humor, broken golf clubs, airborne coffee cups, Christmas party, something about a karaoke machine. Be sure to hit the subscribe button and click the like bell if you saw what you saw. The like bell can be wheelchair accessible upon request. You guys should check this webpage out, it's very bizarre. Caesar salads, brunch, they have brunch. Pork belly hash, bacon and egger. Bacon, <laughs> egger, what's? Plus fried nugs, they say nugs too, yes! Bacon, eggs, and chicken nuggets all together. Yes. That sounds gross. Sounds so good. Doing outros when you're drinking is hard. All right guys, if you're interested in more craft beer reviews or beer, why do you always do that? Do as what? soon as I start, you're like, huh? <laughs> I slouch. <laughs> you like catch it, you're like, I'm slouching. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>